hello everyone this is jerome moses again and uh, welcome back to my channel we have a new video today i'm going to start making a, a series of videos of new defi protocols that have really a fucking insane apys like the one we're going to talk about today is called the jade protocol it's on the binance smart chain the apy if you look through this website the apy let's click on dashboard is over a billion percent yes you had the right as you can see there's a one here it's over a billion percent as that's the apy so so briefly this is what the website says it's an ohm fork that's just better there's a video on the website you can the website how they get to this i got this from coin gecko coin gecko is loading i searched for jade protocol uh, let me type that jade protocol jade protocol is the second one here it's not jade currency but it's jade protocol so you click on jade protocol so this is the price of jade protocol at the moment it's 350 today 24 hour 24 hour range the high price today was four six nine dollars right now it's at 350 it had gone up to 310 so the 24 hour volume is 32 million the total value locks tvl is 87 mil so it's on the binance smart chain and this is the website jadeprotocol.io so this is where i got the website from and this is where we are now so it has really insane apys the team devs from google a harvard professor a viral marketing experts 15 percent of treasure used for buybacks and marketing zero pre-minting zero venture so let the games be it also has a timer here 11 days and 18 hours so the APY is there's a one hidden here. It's not really visible, but it's a one, one, two, two. So it's one billion percent APY. The price is three forty eight dollars. You can see the market cap here is two hundred mil. That's the market cap. The TVL is a hundred mil. The supply is only five ninety six, as it says here. So this is so you the website is here. You can buy. You can click on buy stake. There's also a calculator. If you play around with the calculator, if you have one Z and the future price of Z is this, like the returns seem so so insane, but we shall look at this later. So this is it. So to dive into this, I'm going to put in roughly $25. So I'm going to create a new wallet. I'm going to create a new wallet purposely for this because I don't want to mix it with my other wallets just in case of anything because this is this are really insane APY. So I'm going to create a new wallet. After creating a new wallet, I'm going to the I'm going to send BNB BEP20 either from Binance or you can send it from any other exchange or from your other wallet. So I'm going to create a new wallet. So this I am on my trust wallet and this is my airdrop wallet. So you click on settings you go to wallets as you saw on top here so you to create a new one you a new wallet purposely for this you can see how they have four wallets on trust wallet so you click on the top right corner click on this so create a new wallet and the procedure is really simple so i'll i'll come you have to save the recovery phase if you don't know how to create a wallet i have a video i'll put in the description so i'm going to create wallet i'm going to come back after the wallet is created so our wallet has been created my new wallet i advise you also to create a new wallet if you don't know how to create a new wallet i have I'll, I'll attach a video in the description of this to show you how to create a new wallet so now the next step i have to do is to send smart chain bnb to this new wallet because we need smart chain bnb for the transaction and also for the fees because we shall use smart chain bnb to convert to the jet protocol so you can do that by sending from either Binance, KuCoin, anywhere where Binance is listed or anywhere where you have your Binance is. But for me, I'm going to use Binance. So I'm going to send Binance to this. So you, I went to my Binance account. So I copied the address from my trust wallet from the new address. And then uh, and the network is BEP20 so I'm going to send roughly $28 to or 30 to this new wallet of mine and after that and we do the transaction I've received my BNB already as you can see here on the new wallet it's, it's that it's $27 so the next step now we have to do is now we have to buy Jade 
on pancake swap so i i have to let me go to coin gecko jed is here this is the website let me copy this not really that mm, i can scroll down here to markets here i can copy any of this i can copy either jed busd or jed wbnb but i'm going to use jed bnb because that's what i've sent to my wallet so or we can go straight to the website there's a link dash for this on the website and then we copy this link we copy this link copy this and then we paste it to our dApps on trust wallet authentication needed so we copy it on dApps I copied this link from Jade Protocol. It takes us directly to Pancake Swap. So I'm going to click on this and then I change this Ethereum to Smart Chain. And then it's going since it's our first time using this wallet, we are going to authenticate. Pancake Swap wants to connect your wallet. Connect, accept. So here we are. It's connecting, connect wallet. This is our first time to do this. It's trust wallet, obviously. It's now it's connecting. It's going to show my balance, my BNB balance. So that's here we are. So I told you I'm, I want to buy roughly 25. So what I always do, I change this to BUSD. Uh, and then I can see if I put here 25, 25. So I copy this. So the Z I'm going to buy is 0 point this. So so i copy this and then i change this back to i change the bsd the busd back to to bnb and then let me delete this 25 so just for for the B, for the busd so then i paste the worth of 25 busd i paste it down here and then it will auto complete so why did it go to add BNB. So here we are. So it's roughly 0 0.04. So, so that I'm going to swap 0 0.04 62842 into 0 0.07. So it's roughly. So then I click on swap. Click on swap. So I'm, I'm swapping that. I'm now buying Jed. This is what I'm doing in this. I'm buying roughly 24 or 25 dollars of Jed. And then yeah it's after 25 as you can see so approve they want me to authenticate again it's loading so waiting for confirmation transaction submitted so we can wait just a few minutes and then it's 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 going to so here we are so we are going to have jed mm -hmm. yes there's a notification here smart contract call executed so it's here it's here it's going to the bnb balance is going to show zero even the account is going to show zero until i add manually this is supposed to show zero so i'm supposed to add now it said it's supposed to show zero but it's not really it's, it's showing two so i have a balance of two dollars of smart chain so you might be surprised where is my jade where is my jade yes where is my 25 dollars it's there i have to manually add i have to manually add jade protocol on my trust wallet so i also made a video how to do that but let me go back to this i'm going to copy the address let me note this i'm going to copy this address this contract address this copied and then i add here manually i'm doing it first so I've added the Jade protocol on my Trust Wallet. I have, also have a video on my channel. You can go to Trust Wallet playlist on how to add a custom token. So you can see I've added it here. So our balance is now 27. So which means I bought Jade roughly of, I bought Jade of 0 0.07. So that's roughly $24. So the next step we now have to do is we're going to stake it. That's what you're going to do next. So we are going to stake it so i want to copy the website again and then i copy it here and say jed protocol copy link address i go back to trust wallet and then i paste it to dapps i paste it here this is the website 
and I change this to smart chain from ethereum so Jade protocol wants to connect your wallet since this is a new wallet you saw me creating it so connect wallet yes so now our wallet is connected so remember when I started the video I had this interface so now my wallet is connected as I said there's a calculator you can play with it you can play with the calculator the APY is here insane you can buy if we did that now we want to stake so you click on stake as i said the apy is fucking insane it's one billion as you can see one billion percent one billion percent this is really a high risk investment so to stake you click on you remember i clicked on here stake and then after clicking on stake you also click on approve since it's our first time you have to approve the transaction you have to approve the wallet so it's approving a small fee of zero point one two we are approving it we approve it's loading or oh, we refresh it after approving let's refresh it yes it has been approved that's for the notification it has been approved so now um, we are going to stake remember your earnings per day i don't have it zero i haven't staked anything the price is 354 so we are going to stake i'm going to click on maximum so then I, after that, I click on stake. We also have to approve the smart contract call. So the fee for approving is 0.65. Approve that. Authentication. Mm. So it has been approved, but I just have to refresh this. And then we are there is a pay a payout of the stake tokens eight hourly so it's remaining three hours until the next payment or rebase so here it's already estimating that i'll be earning one dollar per day so let me refresh this let me reload this so if you want to unstake it's still the same thing you come here click on unstake but we don't want to unstake so my staked balance as you can see is 0 0.0709 which is 25 dollars roughly so let's wait for the next let's wait for i'll give a review of this in the next few days or in a week's time so ladies and gentlemen this is how you this is how you buy jed and stake it for this insane apys of one fucking billion percent so this is it by the this is not investment advice you should always do your own research before you invest in any cryptocurrency especially such that have such fucking insane APYs. this is really risky so as they say always invest what you can afford to lose please invest what you can afford to lose so to track your you have to add the here it's going to show zero so i have to add the sj that's the one you're paid in it's called sj i'm going to add i'm going to get the contract address and i'm going to add it i'm going to put the contract address of sj below in the description i added the sj token because if you stake your jed it is converted into sj it is no longer jed so when you want to unstake you click on unstake and convert back the sj into jed and then sell it so as you can see this is exactly the same number of jed i have as per now so i'll leave the contact address below again this is not investment advice always do your own research so I'll update you on other videos and I'll, I'll update you maybe after a week on how this investment is going. Thank you.